right, hey, what's going on, guys? How do you do? It's your boy Gray here. Welcome back to the channel. Let me just say this at the very start of the video so you guys, you know, moving forward, you guys know what's happening here. Uh, this video here, this best class setup video, is probably going to be my last Call of Duty World War II best class setup. I will have a video for you guys tomorrow, but it's more going to be a, a funny kind of a video. It's not necessarily going to have any gameplay or anything like that. So, this right here, guys, is my final. Call of Duty World War II, best class setup, not even just best class, this is probably going to be the last Call of Duty World War II video that I'm going to do with gameplay and stuff like that. Uh, before we before we move on to this video here, uh, to the uh, best class setup for the NZ41, I just want to say real quick, uh, every single person who has been on this road with me uh, for Call of Duty World War II, thank you so much for being a part of this journey. Thank you for having my back during the ups and the downs. Uh, I really... I really did not like, I really don't like this Call of Duty. I thought, in my opinion, once again, this is the worst Call of Duty ever made. It just is. I've played many Call of Duties in my 10 years of playing Call of Duties. I've played many Call of Duties, many different Call of Duties. And this is honestly, it, like from somebody who's been playing for 10 years, this is the worst Call of Duty I've ever played in my life. Uh, they've done a lot of stuff in the, in the past couple months, in the past four or five months to improve the game. And I will give them that. The game is definitely a major improvement right now than what it was when it first came out. It, it definitely is. And I don't mind. Like, I can actually play this game now for a longer period of time than I used to. But it's still a terrible Call of Duty overall. Um, and that's just my personal opinion. I don't mean to offend anybody who's watching this video and you love World War II. I don't mean to offend you. It's just my personal opinion. Everybody is entitled to their opinion. Uh, so, guys, I just want to say real quick. Thank you very much for being a part of this journey here with me on Call of Duty World War II. This is probably going to be the last video, uh, best class setup gameplay kind of a video here that you're going to see on a channel regarding Call of Duty World War II. I don't know if in the future I'll be making other videos. It's it's not, I, don't, I can't predict the future. I don't know, maybe if something really, really special happens in Call of Duty World War II, maybe I'll reinstall it. And if you guys really want a video, I'll just show you a video. But uh, this game is going bye-bye on Thursday, man. So... At least for me it is so guys thank you so much once again for being a part of this journey we've grown i think we entered this we entered call of duty world war ii with about i think it was like 2,000 subscribers and uh right now we're we're 6 000 deep and uh thank you man thank you so much you guys i really sincerely appreciate all the support all right so with all that said with all of that out of the way man let's get into this video welcome to today's video guys the nz41 the brand new assault rifle in call of duty world war ii thanks to this halloween scream event that's happening right now the nz41 not my favorite not my favorite assault rifle by far not my favorite weapon from this halloween scream event either it's it's i don't know it's not for me it's not necessarily my favorite gun but i do have a very very good class setup and this is coming from somebody who doesn't like this gun this is a very good class setup but the gameplay that you guys are going to see today is going to prove to you that it is a good class setup man because i'm not, i don't perform that well with this gun with the best class setup that i have for you guys today we actually ended up going on flag tower we actually ended up dropping a 30 plus 32 32 and 7 on flag tower with this gun with this class setup here so so guys welcome to the video i hope you enjoy the gameplay i hope you enjoy the rest of the video if you guys are brand new to the channel don't forget to subscribe i do upload content every single day make sure to turn on notifications drop a like on the video drop a like hit that thumbs up this is the last one here you guys the last best class setup video that we have for call of duty world war ii and i'm gonna do it on the nz41 the newest uh, assault rifle in the game so drop a like it would really mean a lot moving forward here to black ops 4 i'm really excited man but with all that said let's let me show you the class setup then we'll get into the gameplay and uh yeah here we go so you guys can see here we're actually running the commando division and we're running ordinance and hustle now these two basic training badges are what really help this weapon perform the way it does i mean this gun right here guys it's a in my opinion it's just really slow it has a really slow fire rate mobility everything about this gun is really slow to me so i feel like ordinance is going to help because it's going to allow you to call in that uav it's going to it's going to allow you to call in that artillery uh really quickly uh, as long as you're able to get some kills especially once you get that uav it shouldn't be too difficult to get more kills and chain kills after one kill after another for your score streaks here so ordinance is there so that we can get our score streaks faster hustle is there because this gun has a, like i said everything about this gun is really slow hustle is there guys so that we can reload faster and we can reload while we're sprinting and on the move hustle is definitely important for the nz41 in my opinion there guys uh with the nz41 we're actually going to be running the reflex sight with the green dot i am not a fan of the iron side of this gun by like i've tried it many times and it's just not for me a reflex sight is the way to go if you guys if you guys don't mind an iron sight and you guys actually perform well with it 
I mean, something like advanced rifling is really good. A grip is really good on this as well. But for me, guys, reflex sight, obviously rapid fire. You need that fire rate to, Im to improve to get better. So the, the rapid fire is going to help with that. And last but certainly not least here, guys, extended magazines, just so we don't have to worry about bullets if we go on high streak. So there you guys have it. That is the best class setup there. That is the best attachments. Our secondary is a launcher. Uh, lethal is a sticky grenade. All right, so there you guys have it. That is the best class setup here for the NZ41. I mean, the gameplay that you guys are about to see is going to speak for itself. 32 and 7 on Flag Tower. It just really brings out the best in this weapon. And I guess in my game style as well, because I'm pretty aggressive. So with all that said, guys, I hope you enjoyed the rest of the video. Like I said, this is probably the last one here. And uh, I'll have another one for you guys tomorrow, but it's more like a fun video. It's, it's more like a joking kind of video here. But uh, yeah, guys, thank you so much for the love and support. Thank you for being with me on this journey. We're going to end it here with the NZ41 best class setup. Uh, once again, subscribe if you're new, turn on notifications, and drop a like on today's video. It really does help out. I look forward to seeing you guys on Black Ops 4, man. I'm, I'm going to work hard for you guys. So thank you all so much for the support. Enjoy the rest of the gameplay. I'm going to back out of here. And for the last time on Call of Duty World War II, Till the next time, guys, my name is Gray. Peace. Enemy in the okay. Take another year. Take another year. Recon aircraft awaiting orders. Go. Recon searching for targets. That, me. That was me. I knew he was there. I bad bad aim on my part. Flight concluded. Recon aircraft ready for mission. Recon searching for targets. press square but I don't know where that came from. Good grenade I guess. Firing battery one. Target position confirmed. Shotgun bitch. Recon aloft. We have eyes in the sky. Ah. Ah. Damn, behind me. Oh no, that was a friend. Damn it. The shots from behind me threw me off. Flight concluded. Really? I 
that's that's the power move, huh? I'm telling you, man, this class setup really brings out the best out of this out of this weapon, man. And, and it's a weapon that I'm not even a big fan of, but this class setup does bring out the best in this gun. 32 and 7, you guys. Try it out. Try it out for yourselves, man. All right, so there you guys have it, man. The best class setup here for the NZ-41, the brand new assault rifle in the game. Let me know in the comment section below if you guys have any thoughts, opinions, or questions about this gun. I hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for being a part of this journey here on World War II with me. It really means the world to me, guys. Uh, I appreciate all the love and support. Thank you so much for being by my side during this uh, during this World War II time. And uh, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. This is probably the last World War II video that I'm going to be uploading. So once again, guys, thank you so much. Moving on and moving forward here to uh, Black Ops 4. I'm really excited for that. Make sure to subscribe to the channel if you're new so you can stay up to date with everything Black Ops 4, everything Black Ops 4 related. Subscribe if you're new, turn on notifications, drop a like, all that good stuff, you guys. Thank you so much. I'm going to back out of here. Until the next one, my name is Gray. Peace.